here in this video we are going to learn binary addition and this we are going to learn with two examples of two layer and three layers of addition so without wasting time let's get started this binary addition is similar to the decimal addition but the only difference is the binary addition is limited to only two digits 0 and 1 so when we add two binary digits the result looks like this when we add 0 plus 0 gives 0 when we add 0 plus 1 that gives 1 when we add 1 plus 0 that gives 1 and when we add 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and the carry to the next column is 1 now how this happens that I will explain using next example so now let's explore that example so these are the two numbers and we are going to add them together so now adding these two numbers together will start with the rightmost column and then subsequently we will move towards the left hand side now here when we add 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carries 1 to the next column so to understand this let's have an example of decimal addition when we add 1 plus 1 in decimal the sum is 2 and when we add 8 plus 5 in decimal the sum is 13 in decimal there are 10 distinct digits from 0 to 9 so when the sum of any two digits become more than 9 the carry is generated and transferred to the next column so here we will write the sum as 3 and carry as 1 to the next column if this column is 1's column then the next column will be 10's place in decimal so now here we have only 1 and there is no other digit so 1 plus 0 gives us 1 over here and the final answer we get as 13 so this is simple decimal procedure and that we all are aware about the same way everything happens in binary in binary there are only two distinct digits 0 and 1 so whenever the sum of two digits becomes more than 1 a carry to the next column is generated when we add 1 plus 0 in binary the sum is 1 and when we add 1 plus 1 in decimal 1 plus 1 is 2 and the binary equivalent of 2 is 1 0 so when we add 1 plus 1 in binary then the sum will be 0 and the carry to the next column will be 1 now the 1 here is in 2's place and if we add it with 0 we will get 1 over here so the decimal of this binary 2 plus 0 gives us 2 so finally we get 1 0 as the summation of 1 plus 1 in binary so now let's come back here so when we add these two digits 1 plus 1 the sum will be 0 and carry to the next column will be 1 so now let's add these two digits 1 plus 1 the sum will be 0 and carry to the next column will be 1 now here 0 plus 1 gives us 1 so that's how we can add these numbers together now let's come to the next column 1 plus 1 the summation will be 0 and carry to the next column will be 1 now 0 plus 0 is 0 now let's jump to the next column 1 plus 0 is 1 and 1 plus 1 is 0 and carry to the next column is 1 now again over here 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carry to the next column will be 1 now 0 plus 1 gives us 1 now here we have one carry but no digit is available into these numbers so by default we will take it as 1 so 1 plus 0 plus 0 gives us 1 so that's how you can add two binary numbers the decimal equivalent to this number is 23 and decimal equivalent to this number is 27 so 23 plus 27 is 50 now just check this out that the decimal equivalent to this binary number is 50 or not after this two layer now it's time to add three layers of binary number and here we have the three layers of number so now let's start 1 plus 0 plus 1 1 plus 0 is 1 so now we'll directly add 1 plus 1 the summation is 0 and carry to the next column will be 1 now let's add these two number first 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carry to the next column is 1 now 0 plus 1 is 1 and there is no carry for that now again this 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carry to the next column is 1 so in this summation we have added two carries so now we'll move towards the next column it is this one so 1 plus 1 plus 0 so finally it is 1 plus 1 so when we add 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and the carry to the next column is 1 0 plus 1 the sum is 1 
Now it's time for the next column. 1 plus 1, the sum is 0 and carry to the next column is 1. 0 plus 0 is 0 and 0 plus 1 is 1. So the sum of this entire column is 1. And now here we have 1 carry. As you can see, we have 1 carry but there is no digit left in any of this number. So we'll directly write this carry over here. So 1, 1, 1, 0, 0 is the addition of these three binary numbers. Now that was the whole number addition. Similar to this, if you want to learn binary addition of fraction number, then you can refer this video. And if you want to learn binary subtraction, then you can refer this video. Here there are two binary addition is provided for the self practice. Solve this right now and write the answer in comments to check the answer you get is correct or not. So now let's jump to the next video.